Welcome to SRB TV. We are here. Hello everyone, welcome to our episode of SRB TV. I am Kristen. I'm Christopher. And on today's episode, we're taking a look at Harley Quinn Season 3, Episode 5. It's a swamp thing. Previously on Harley Quinn, we went to an uh, unconfirmed orgy. Yes, for the Court of Owls. With the Court of Owls, um, only to find, only for them to find out that Court of Owls didn't kidnap um, Frank. Somebody else did. Somebody with a mole on their ass. Um, uh, they also uh, Harley and I, uh, Ivy both revealed to each other that they've been kind of like. Mm -hmm. uh, lying, kind of sort of lying to each other and stuff I mean, like that. They're hitting that moment in a relationship where it's like trust issues. That's the thing. It's like, it's that boundary of like. At least she, and, but then Ivy admits why she never told Harley yeah. about her relationship with Catwoman because like Ivy wanted so much for her relationship, but Catwoman was Catwoman and didn't really give anything. She back. wasn't all about commitment, let's put it that way. Yeah. And they were able to cross that bridge, but the hunt is on. Frank is currently tied right now somewhere. And with the, the sound of his next episode, it's gonna be very interesting. That's right. Hopefully, Swamp Thing doesn't die. I like Swamp Thing. Hopefully, don't kill him. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, let's dive into this. Yeah. Let's dive into this. Four, Harley Quinn season three, episode five. It's a Swamp Thing. So here we go. But she needs more help from Swamp Thing. Oh, she's looking through all the plants. Yeah, that's what I said. So that's what I said. Like you said, she's uh, was it? She needs Swamp Thing's help to tap in, to tap into more. So did you do it? Did you get another green? Did you find out where Frank is? Harl. No. 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 Fucking no. No. Fucking no. no. Fucking no. Frank's in trouble. Oh no! We knew that already. Also that. It's like we knew that already. And? Okay. Cancel. Um. Oh no. <laughs> she was frozen for 25 years. I think it's exactly the kind of break you both need. Just a double. Oh, isn't she fucking? This is my driver. We just did coke up the Yeah. She's literally like part Yeah, of after what happened out. in the season two. <laughs> No, I'm good, thank you. What the fuck happened to her? Dr. Freeze made the ultimate sacrifice for her to turn into a bimbo? A party animal. I know I know she's YOLOing because of like how long she's been frozen, but... Uh, oh, I don't know how they're going to pick the small thing in this. Because after all those heroes we've seen so far, it's like, I'm afraid. I think... It's not a terrible idea. So, you know, he lives in the swamps of New Orleans. You know, you can first just negotiate with him. He's kind of a neutral figure in the DC universe. Yeah. Oh god, that's right, the Billy Bob Thornton thing. I so wish I could dip a world famous Dumont's beignet into a fresh cup of joy. It's not a party. Mm -hmm. Jesus Christ. Never believe that. <laughs> We're still at the airport! You have to leave. Cats. These cats are special. They're version. I named them Martha and Thomas. After your dead parents. I didn't realize. I didn't realize. I just consider them to be strong Christian names. I'm not. <laughs> I just consider them to be strong Christian names. Bruce. <laughs> then I thought it'd be cool when she moved on for life. I'm looking for a thing down in a swamp. Hey! Constantine! Awesome! His first appearance! <laughs> Give us a thing, won't you, love? Oh, it's Matt Ryan! Yes! <laughs> Tell us where Swamp Thing is. I can't just go about giving that information. Hey, Constantine, bring your Houdini ass over here. <laughs> Houdini <laughs> ass, let's do this. Nope, not ready to drop that wall yet. Team Brangelina, <laughs> I take the shark. She has a hamburger in her mouth. She had a hamburger. <laughs> 
you two. Chai lattes. Yeah, That's they all did. we want. They did. Martha. Oh, there's only one character that doesn't get Harley Quinn. Oh, uh, 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 <laughs> one guy, yes, Harley Quinn. Very funny. Master hey, guys. Like this. I'm fine, Alfred. And it's he's real. offering him TT, yeah, which is weird. Hey, is Linda home? Uh, we got divorced. She said we weren't compatible, and also everything about me is disgusting. Mm. Sounds familiar. Wow. Oh my I, god. So it's just, you I know. Alec and I connected beyond the physical. But yes, we fucked. Oh, yes! Every yes! Beautiful and majestic creature stumbles into your home drunk. Well, looks falling under my bed. It's the music maestro. Ah, oh, she said it! Got it! Hey, it's music maestro. It's music maestro. This one's version. Of... He sounds familiar too! Why the fuck? I'm participating in this buffoonery, so how about you choke on my ass? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my ass. We met nine hours ago. Okay, I give her that part. We met, we met nine hours ago. Fun, Alec. Oh no, oh no! You literally dumped the guy who learned to control nature. Run! Oh goddamn! Great. Yeah, but you still could have lied just for a little bit. This sucks. Literally affecting the ecosystem. Okay, that is pretty cool though. You got a man. So Alfred hired the music maestro as her therapist. Yeah, as their therapist. So I think he sees this. I think he sees the same thing that they have it's a like connection. Like hiring Lex Luthor as a guidance counselor. I mean, it'll work, but like, you may have some weird side effects. Like to lose someone? The only reason why I came down here is because I lost my best friend. He's the only person who understood me as me before Harley. I'm so worried about. Great wording. And I don't Great yeah. fucking wording. I can't find his dream because I'm not strong enough. And every second that I spend here, he's slipping away from me. I need you the most. Oh, thank God you're okay. Whoa! <laughs> Fair, she deserves it. fine, Frank. That's fine, Frank. I really learned Jesus Christ, her hair! It's getting worse and worse. It's like level two now. Like level three. All at once. To access the green. Hey, you're ready. Oh, shit. I hate it when the power was inside me all the Oh, oh no. no. I hate that too. I hate that. <gasps> what? Wait. So, why did you. Bruce Wayne has him! Master Bruce, what? He's doing his Batman thing, trying to figure out, trying to figure out what's going on with Frank. But do they know he's Batman? So that was a fun episode. Yes, it was. Uh, we got to meet this version of Earl, of uh, Swamp Thing. Swamp Thing. <laughs> Which really, like he's not only that. The first big surprise. Matt Ryan. Yeah, Matt Ryan as uh, Constantine for like a quick, for like one quick, scene. Quick, for this, like, a little bit of a scene, but it was cool to see him return into his uh, titular role. Yeah, and we see what become of Nora Freeze. She's Arvita. basic. I know, I get what they're doing with her. Like, she, she's just trying to YOLO. Yeah, she's... I'm, and I'm not saying that, like... No, 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 I, yeah, no. no, no I'm saying that, like, I'm not saying that like a, like a term I use. No, no, no just, she it's, is literally doing the YOLO thing. Yeah, because, like, she's been frozen for so long, she's doing anything and everything. And literally, when we mean that, literally doing everything. I, I love that part where even Ivy, well, after something goes and starts going on a rampage, she goes, you could have just lied to him for, like... It, it, like fucking, like fucking a couple hours. Like you could just light just for a little bit, you know. It's like, come on. Um. Then we got uh, uh, Bruce and Selena dealing with their couple's issues. And, so like, Alfred decides to uh, review them and send them to musical maestro therapy. Yeah. Which is the second time Dietrich Bader has had to encounter music maestro. Which is cool. Battle. I like that. That's pretty cool. <laughs> I dived into that. Um. But. Yeah, it's a, it's a type of thing. It was one of those situations where it was all in her. It was just a mental block, mental break, you know, block that she had that was holding her back from actually, you know, really tapping into it. 
but now she sees that Bruce Wayne has them. Yeah, which it doesn't come as like for us, it doesn't come as a surprise that Batman's investigating it, considering what happened to them all yeah. and stuff like that. That makes and it, it makes perfect sense because it's like again we're viewing a, uh, we're seeing this from the point of view from the villains. So wait, does Bruce Wayne have a mole on his ass? Good God, he's got a mole on his ass. Um, that, so, but um, I know for one thing, I believe they don't know he's Batman. No, they don't. As they the don't. last time I checked, I don't like only two of the supervillains know he's Batman. That's Joker and I believe the Riddler. Mm -hmm. I don't remember. I know two villains knew who, who he really was. And they don't know really for sure that you know not no they don't know at all that Catwoman was it was dating him. You know? Oh no! Of course not. That that's fine. I don't. But you know, I'm not saying anything because that's a good thing. Because it's like at least it's like because if they would have found out, they're like, okay, we need to talk to Cat One. Yeah. Type of situation. But like you said, it was another good episode. They they only briefly brought up Clayface, the B Billy Bob Thornton Clayface. Are uh, you still doing? He's still going to rehearsals or go, still going to, uh, you know, posing at it as him and everything like that. Yeah, but that's yeah, that's really it. Um, so now they know that Bruce Wayne has Frank. Now they get the. I wouldn't be surprised and if the next and episode what, is them infiltrating Wayne Manor. And that's why, and that's why I said that's what I love about this is that it is pretty much it's it, people don't realize going wait a minute we're we're still in the point of view of the villains so it's like it's like we're normally we're on the other side of like okay it makes sense what Batman and what he's doing and then it's like on this side it's like what the fuck wait 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 what and then it's like you keep forgetting remember he's a hero you know it's like he's doing his Batman thing so he's he has to investigate to see what's going on. So it makes perfect sense. Yeah. So other than that, folks, if you're new to the channel, you can hit the like button. If you want to talk to us more about stuff like this, comment down below. If you want to share us around, share it around. And I feel like it's just a little bit more than anybody else when it comes to talking about uh, show, uh, DC shows like this one. Hit the subscribe button down below. Hit that bell icon as well. Let us know what you guys thought of this. Uh, do you guys do you guys enjoy it? Was it cool to see Matt Ryan return just for a little bit as Constantine? Um, and what did you guys think of their, uh, <laughs> you probably say it, Harley Quinn's version of Swamp Thing? <laughs> you guys have fun with that? I think it was really cool to, how they depicted him. A divorcee, pretty much, <laughs> type, of, type of guy and has very sensitive feelings. But let us know what you guys' thoughts are. Put down what you thought of our reaction overall, but most importantly, we thank you for watching. Yes, and uh, you can check out all of our previous reactions to Harley Quinn right here on the channel. And on the next episode of SRB TV dealing with Harley Quinn. We will be tackling season three, episode six. <laughs> Joker, the killing vote. Oh yeah, the 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 uh, the, the elections. The, the elections. The mayoral elections. Yeah. So uh, I guess uh, um, until next time, though, I'm Kristen. I'm Christopher. And this has been a very beignet filled episode of SRB TV. See ya later. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to check out any of our previous reactions, as well as one of our other SRB shows, check out one of the playlists down below. And if you want to check us out in the social universe, you can find us on Twitter and Stardust at Super React Bros. As well as on Facebook at Super Reaction Bros.